be like you cook South African South Africa or it could be like hello fresh how the Americans do it uh, but the only difference is that I'm not getting the groceries delivered actually what am I saying no uh -uh. moments in my life Today we are, today is a Friday, Javi and I are both on leave, I hope you guys can actually hear me. Uh, we are here to have a breakfast date at Cafe Nore, Cafe Nove, it's in Lelusia Mall. It's my first time coming here, Javi has been here for the meetings. Um, so, yeah, uh, spend, the, spend the day with me. Later on, we're gonna go do some picking up some stuff from the store. So, we're gonna do that. Um, and then, yeah, we'll see what the day holds. Um, yeah. Do you guys like my pom poms? I think this is gonna be my new hairstyle with my locks now because I find it so cute. So yeah, uh, I will see you guys later. Nobody knows she I Oh, for men, it's evil. Oh, it's evil. Oh, it's okay. Mm. One thing about me, I will influence my family and people I know to buy Porsche M, honey. Guys, so I am back home. Uh, came back home then uh, because your auntie was here then your auntie left then we went to checkers to go and buy um, a few stuff it's, it's not I'm not gonna call it groceries just a few stuff so let me show you quickly what I got so we got eggs potatoes banana Pears, a mini cucumber, lettuce, yogi said I was craving it, and then liquid fruit. These are now 45 46 rand each. Hey guys, from 30 rand to 46 rand each, and then milk for three cartons, and then hot chocolate. Because it's winter, the way we are drinking so much hot beverages, hence we bought these three because we've just run out of our six pack. And this happens, this happens every winter. Um, winter, Jay, we run out of a six pack, yet during summer, the six pack lost us for the month. Uh, in winter, it does not, it is not because we drink a lot of hot chocolate, coffees, teas, um, uh, yeah. 
So let me pack this stuff away and then I'm not sure about cooking tonight, hey? I should cook actually. Let me see what am I gonna cook. Mm, I'll make steak. I'll make steak. And yeah, I'll make steak with mashed potato. Yeah, that's gonna be supper. So I will see you later when we make supper together. If you've been, been here, but tomorrow we're going to be having, guys. If you've been, been here, thank you so much for being a day one. And if you're watching for all of the stuff, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. You've got me saying words in my head. Filling my mind with these images. And it's the way that you look at me. Makes me feel like. Good morning guys uh, It is a couple of days later uh, I think the last time I picked up the camera was on Friday uh, Today is Sunday I have been actually just uh, went out for a hike And he seems to have lost his car keys So he's going to send me an Uber to then drop off uh, his um, his second set of keys so I'm just gonna get quickly get ready and then I'm going to take you guys with okay my battery is low So my battery is low so I am going with my power bank and my cable. Shame man, my poor baby. I'm sure he is hating himself right now for losing the car keys on the trail. Shame. My hair is growing, guys. I actually need to go and get my hair done. 
I really need to go and get my hair done. Oh, the battery is flicking. Okay. Let me change the battery and then I will see you guys when we are in the Uber. Until the coach, he had bought. Ah, and I'm exercising. Go in. Then you go to where you are going. What is that saying? Go in. Can you just try now? Yeah, boy, yeah, boy, yeah, boy. Steep boom. There's a good hike though. <laughs> That's a baby. Oh, but no, so fair, I'm on time. No, but see. Ah, I need to finish it. I need to buy less today, Paul. Actually, you and you and you and you down. Okay. You and you down to up. So, since I'm a foot, if you find me, I'll be like. Eh, oh, so far, I'm going to let the pagets in and lose it. That's why you said I know. I'm going to get a look here. Mm hmm. I'm going to look for my children. And it took, to get to that point, it took, took about one and a half hours, eh? Is it? Mm. Yo! So that was a walk and a half. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but that, eh? Pleasure, baby. Good. So I'm editing this vlog. It has already gone up. Click the link down in the description box below. And I'm having, uh, this is a burger roll. I cut it in half, put it in the oven to just toast a bit. And then just made egg with, with uh, tomato sauce. And then I'm having uh, five roses tea. Let me continue editing and yeah, see you later alligator. Uh, uh. I just want to show you guys my obsession with candles. Like, okay, these are obviously running on empty. And this is going to be my last burn for them. I'm going to turn them off and up soon. Then let me show you this other one that I got from Mr. Price. It doesn't have much of a scent. Yeah, I was charging my AEG cordless. Um, battery there actually while i'm on that topic i just want to quickly say wuti aeg power tools are the bomb.com i received these power tools from them uh in february end of feb and i've been using them as you've seen in videos and stuff um and it's only now it's we are in june now and it's only now that i'm actually charging the batteries so that should give you an indication of the battery life obviously i don't spend a whole hour with the drill pressed down on an object drilling i drill put the drill down do something else drill put the drill down put do something else but the fact that i got these at the end of february and I'm, it's only now that i'm <laughs> charging the batteries that should give you an indication of the battery life aeg is on the pricier side compared to ryobi but when it comes to um, duration, when it comes to the quality of their engine, when it comes to uh, the durability, AEG is, is, is obviously number one. However, with Ryobi, the price point makes it more 
rent it makes it more diy um friendly but obviously if you want to invest in a power tool and you want the power tool to last you a long time I would say put in that extra couple of rands and get yourself an AEG uh, that way you know it'll last you until even your great grandchildren come to the world okay maybe I'm exaggerating in that regard but yeah no uh, the quality of if I were to choose between AEG and Ryobi right now I'm currently really impressed by uh, AEG's quality um, um, Ryobi you'll you, you know you'll know Ryobi has always been my first love but AEG is really coming close eh? really coming close to taking that number one spot but anyway I actually just wanted to show you all my candles and how obsessed I am with the fact that I've got so many candles that are burning in the house at the same time and no it doesn't affect the smell of a particular candle i know the scent of each candle so i just love a house that just smells lovely okay so i was saying that this one i got it from mr prize home and it doesn't have much of a scent it is cute though but yeah uh, from a scale of one to ten ten being amazing this is a four Oh yeah, let me also give you a quick uh, scale with this one. This one I got from Macro a year and a half ago. I don't know, last year. Uh, and then this one I got from Mr. Price a year and a half ago. But I didn't burn it a lot, to be honest. Because I just found this, this, the scent to be too potent. And this one is called... I'm not even going to try and pronounce that. So let me give it a quick scoring. This one out of from one to ten, I'm giving it a definite six. I really love this baby. Um, I'm actually going to restock it. I hope Macro still has. And then this baby, I'm giving it a six out of ten. Because it has to grow on you, you know? And then this one also I got it from Mr. Price and honestly I just got it because it just looked cute. Well it doesn't honestly look cute from this angle. Okay yeah but it looked cute you guys are going to see it um, uh, in an upcoming video on my main channel. Then this one from GM Candles and you can tell that I love a candle when I literally burn it till there's no burn left so this is a gm candle um i got it last year and it's just such a it's, it's a stunning candle but obviously it also burns so beautifully so so beautifully and yes um i actually was supposed to stop burning it when it hit this this mark this mark but i burnt it until it hit here proudest moments but hey and because i love it so much i've already restocked another one so yeah can't wait to burn it guys and gm candles is from my girl Okuku mazibubo i will link her website down in the description box below please check her out she's also um, a content creator here on the socials uh, she's also Durban based so please do check out her business and uh, support a black owned female business baby okay and also because of the fact that her stuff is amazing all right it is now I'm going to make supper. I'm going to make spaghetti and mince. You guys have seen me make this before. Uh, and what we actually do with our meals here in this house is because I'm tired of always stressing about what to cook, what to make. We have a list here that um, of, of meals we're going to have. We actually were following this religiously for a good three months. 
and then I think we got bored or oh, I got bored now we follow it sometimes sometimes we don't follow it yeah now it's just a mess so I'm thinking that since I got uh, this C4 the cooking husband cookbook what I should do is look through the cookbook see meals that I can incorporate in our weekly meals and cook that it would be like you cook in South Africa or it could be like hello fresh how the Americans do it uh, but the only difference is that I'm not getting the groceries delivered actually what am I saying no uh-uh what are you saying basically I'll be following his cookbook uh, but, but not for today's meal I think that's what I'm going to do from next week when we go and buy groceries so I'm going to do a list uh, of groceries and we are going to completely change out this meal um, this meal ideas and start incorporating meals from his cookbook he's got really nice uh, meals here he's got break he's got lunch meals uh, supper dessert um, creamy sam bride mustard sirloin steak roast barbecue chicken some of these meals are more meals that you could have on a Sunday. Uh, they're more Sunday wholesome type of meals. Uh, I'm gonna try and see if I can incorporate them on a during the week. Uh, but but they, they are quite heavy, hey? They are quite heavy. But we'll see what I can incorporate and what I can't incorporate. I'll obviously um, have it for Sunday meals. So let me let me prep for supper now. Chop my onions, green pepper, my set up my spaghetti and my mince, my spices, and then cook. And yeah, let's cook, guys.
Okay, so I am making, as I said, mince and spaghetti. So chopped up tomatoes, onions, a green pepper, mince, ginger and garlic, steak and chops, barbecue, spice, peri peri, crushed chilies, and Worcester sauce, yeah, whatever, whichever way it's pronounced, la sauce, le. and then spaghetti. I have my candle lit so that the spice smells good. And then, not that anyone has asked, but I got these pots from Checkers. Um, they came in a set of they came in a set of seven uh, so I'm gonna cook in this pan the mince in this pan and then uh, the spaghetti in this pot and have we got me these so I'm gonna trim these and put them in a vase yeah let's cook guys Yeah, so let's cook. Trapped inside the mind of a dreamer, losing sight of all the visions in my head. I've been tossing all my thoughts off the deep end, drowning out my fears with tears in. keeping your roses or your flowers fresh um, or staying on longer is cutting the is cutting the stems at an angle and then ensuring that the leaves do not touch the water Surprise when Mr. Price wasn't overpriced, when it wasn't ridiculously overpriced. So I'm using all, uh, all, they're not all, the new chopsticks that are extra from my drawer. I'm going to throw these away. I'm not going to cook with, I'm not going to eat out of them. I've got like 10 other ones in my, in my drawer. So I'm just going to throw this away.
guys, it's Honda Zami. It is now the next day, and I just finished assembling this uh, headboard finally. I built it out of pellets. Um, I am doing a DIY, so it will definitely be on my DIY YouTube channel. So click the link down in the description box below to see the full video and its full assembling process. I just came on here to end of the vlog over here. Oof, I don't go boom llama. So I just came on here to just uh, end off the vlog over here. Hi, bo. To end of the vlog over here, and I will see you guys next week. Uh, don't forget to follow me on social media on instagram youtube on instagram twitter tiktok facebook at diy yolandi i'm diy yolandi on all social media platforms and i hope you've hit that red subscribe button and subscribe to this vlog channel um i love you guys so so much i hope you enjoyed this vlog and see you next week bye